I've been working with India for quite some time, and um, I, I would say my experience with Indian uh, scientists is limited to a few, and um, I was hoping to meet other places where I haven't been before, talk to the people there, see what they have, and uh, get an impression about uh, other places that I haven't visited uh, so far regarding the science there and also the people. And what I would like to see is also to get closer connections to Indian groups, also to see how the development is here of uh, teaching and science. I was mostly impressed by the new uh, ICER Institute in Pune because this is a, a, a very brand new institute uh, we were talking to the young scientists there that had been very carefully selected and it was extremely impressive for me to see how professional, uh, how on a, on a very, very high level um, this institution is being set up. And I'm very curious to see how this further develops. I would even recommend students of mine to go there if some uh, mutual benefit um, would show up in, in uh, uh, you know, establishing a, co a collaboration. I'm really impressed, I must say, and it's, it's heartwarming, an Indian would say, here, what I experienced, how interested the Indian scientists, how, how important Germany is for them and how they admire working in Germany and I met a lot of uh, Alexander von Humboldt uh, fellows and they still um, very much honor uh, Germany and see this period of their time as a very fruitful period and this is also motivates me very much also continuously to educate uh, Indian PhD students because this will be a return. I mean, when they are here, have groups, have contacts to our group or to other groups in Germany, I think, I think it's, it's really important. What I've experienced in particular today in the poster sessions is that the, at least the Indian students I spoke to were excellent. I mean, really, they were really well prepared to present their data on the posters and also to, um, to uh, communicate the data they had. So I, I'm really impressed about that. And this is really something what I think is important for German scientists as a take-home lesson message that a lot of things are happening here. Uh, I think this is a very good idea because um, the various funding organizations um, are have, have a different reputation in India. Um, many of the professors that we met during the research dialogue, uh, they have even written on their cards that they are former Alexander von Humboldt fellows. And so the Alexander von Humboldt Society has a very high standing here in India, and so has the DAAD. Whereas my impression is that the DFG is less well known, and therefore it makes sense to present, uh, or, uh, to, to make a joint presentation of the German research dialogue to illustrate that all these different funding organizations kind of work together in Germany and that it's not here the Humboldt, here the DFG doing different things. The intention of these organizations is to, prom to promote a research dialogue with um, India and other countries and to um, show the attractiveness of Germany as a place to do research and to foster careers regardless as to whether the people the scientists go back to India or go abroad and become professors elsewhere. So I think this is a very good idea.